So what you can also do is you can generate out AI images by using Microsoft Designer while you're designing uh, your post from scratch. So over here you can see that this is the home piece and generate image is an option. So I'm just going to go around and click right here. And then what happens is that I can go around and add in a description of the image that I want to generate. So I'm just going to go around and say a dog using computer right here, just like this. And uh, I'm just going to go around and uh, then see in uh, a 2D a pencil, a pencil sketch style right here just like this and then go around and click on this one and what happens is that it'll use um, AI to generate out the image right here. So you do have to wait a bit as you can see right here. So it is going around and taking that description and turning it into a design right there. So you can see that it is taking a while for that. And there you go. This is what you have as you can see in a 2D sketch style. There is this particular uh, dog right here, which is actually going around and set it, um, and using a computer right here. So you can go around and select this as you can see right here. You can select it out and that has been added in as you can see right here. And I'm going to go around and say learn sketch right here as my description of the design that you can go around and generate. And what happens is that by using the AI image and the description, it will generate out designs for you right here. So you can see that this is what you have right here. So this is what you have as you can see. So you can see it says master the basic of sketch with this step-by-step -step guide. So you can go around and customize up the design. And by using this particular um, AI image and then by using the prompt, you can see that it has generated out the design uh, for me. So that is how you can generate out designs. Uh, that is, you can generate out images. Uh, so that is how you can generate out images and use it to uh, uh, to generate out, out designs inside of Microsoft Designer. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.